Welcome back, and we're back on our labyrinth, labyrinth deck, and um, looking to see if I made any changes. I don't, I don't think I made any changes. So you could go ahead and skip up if you already know, or you don't want to watch the deck profile. That's fine. Let's get straight to the video because we have a good one. This replay was crazy. I'm hyping it up, so I hope you enjoy it. Now, if you stuck around, <laughs> let's go through it. We have Absolute King Bag Jack. I don't think he is needed more than just once. No, I think he's still really good to have at least one of. Because of the trap, Ghastly, Ghastly Glitch. So that and Bag Jack is a really good combo. Ku Klux, Stovey, and this one are all good just to have in the hand throw away set a trap and it could be good for going second too so i have a good amount of these you could maybe lower them if you want to add more traps but they're okay they're an okay option going second you wait until your opponent ends the turn and then boom you're able to set a trap and you can activate it on your turn and then we got the maids ariane and ariana three arianas i think is best and ariane or ariana <laughs> i don't know is good at like two to one really archfiend i'm running we're running as many labyrinth cards as possible so we have archfiend at one bigfoot is here just because you know not even i'm not even too sure but he's a good target for eradicator so that's fine obviously if you're you want to be more you know better with it instead of bigfoot i would say run heavenly lords or whatever that card's called and then you're able to search eradicator off of that so that's a pretty cool combo my lovely lady of the silver love wait oh, i should i i sworn there was a lady in there whatever lovely labyrinth it's a really good card have two of i think two is fine you don't want a brick with three and you don't one just feels too small pot you, we don't use an extra deck really so pot at three is fine two labyrinth labyrinths is good no one runs setup but i do i think setup is okay it has its moments and then we got bottomless compulsories probably in every single labyrinth deck infinite not too much but it's in the gate i guess but it's not really a trap you would want to have dogmatica punishment however i think it's pretty good in this deck and then it's good if you have the right things to throw out and then stained glass is not you probably wouldn't want to run this one either but i run it just just for the fun of it <laughs> and then welcome labyrinth fair welcome labyrinth and labyrinth barrage are all here they're all the labyrinth traps some people probably don't run if they're not running orange fiend they're not running fair welcome and no one really runs labyrinth barrage but i'm running all of them because we are pure labyrinths for the most part <laughs> and then ghastly we talked about this for the extra deck none of them matter except if you want to throw away with dogmatica punishment either entis wind pegasus and that's really it. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the replay. It was a good one. I hope you enjoy it. This duel was insanity. Allow me to show you. I, I, I'm not going to speed up. I should though, because it might be a little long. We will use Labyrinth Labyrinth and Ariana to give us welcome. Set, 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 set. <laughs> okay. Now, what are we going against? Fright Fur, okay. It's definitely not pure Fright Fur, so it's definitely branded Fright Fur or something. Albaz, whatever, yep. Yeah, perfect, look at that. Branded Fusion. Labellion, okay. It's a nice Labellion you have there. Allow me to... Am I gonna... Yep. Welcome, Labyrinth! Welcome to our Labyrinth. Let me show you around. Never mind, you left, because you were scared of the Labyrinth. He didn't want to see the Labyrinth. <laughs> I was about to treat you to our host, Lovely Labyrinth! Our hostess, I mean, sorry. Okay, whatever, you're bringing out another fusion. Do we care? Do we care? We found a new mirror jade, it's kind of a problem. However, since we got rid of a card, Ariana and Lovely Labyrinth, and you, I guess, whatever, you're in the Labyrinth 2 for now. Eradicator Epidemic! I won't allow you to banish her, but you have quick play spells. Why are all their branded cards quick play? That's so trash. They have enough. I couldn't even epidemic them, bro, because they, they're they quick plays. They just use them. Maybe if I would have did it like frame one, 
when they had nothing in the graveyard. Could have done it. My bad, y'all. That definitely would have made this battle easier, but it would not have been as crazy. You're banishing my Ariana. Whatever. We summon. We'll, we'll at least have a line of defense. And you protected your mirror, Jade. Screw you, buddy. But whatever. We have a fiend now on the field. So I will activate my Labyrinth Labyrinth. And also my Ghastly Glitch. It only works if we had a fiend. And good thing we drew one. Back, Jack. Get rid of your... I don't care if you protect your mirror, Jade. She won't be protected long. Lovely comes back. Keep adding cards. And summoning monsters, I guess. Whatever. Yep. Okay, whatever. Back, Jack. Allow me to reorder my deck. Mm -hmm. Okay, now banish yourself to allow me to add a card. I know what it is. It's punishment, and we set it right away. And activate it even sooner. By using punishment, we will get rid of the masquerade. And Entis will get rid of, um, what you call it, that one. And then Albaz will, okay. And he takes all three. Interesting. Nice. Good job, Albaz. <laughs> okay. How much more help do you need? Ah, damn it. I refuse. I refuse to lose here. But you have no cards in your hand, Silver Chan. <laughs> I'm, I'm not done yet. Heart of the cards. Guide me. Draw. Compulsory. Okay, whatever. Set it. I end my turn. Is that all you can do? No. Because we're not done yet. You drew a brand infusion. The virus is still active. And now we'll use compulsory. But you had an... Uh oh, you had something you can play after that, I see. You have two monsters to my none. Make that one. You bring back Masquerade. So that makes compulsory do nothing. You thought I wasted my compulsory. However, it was a non-labyrinth trap. So I will be able to summon a labyrinth. And I choose the hostess again. And you just keep bringing that guy back. He just keeps leaving and coming, leaving and showing up. You choose to attack, however. I will negate the attack. Fair welcome. You protected him again. But you can't protect him twice. Labyrinth. Since we were able to take out a monster. A monster left of the field. Le left the field. Nope, 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 nope. Since a monster left the field due to a labyrinth trap card. That's what started this chain. Okay. Which makes welcome come back. Which makes this come back to our hand. We always had options. And I'm allowed to pop because of lovely. And that's it. The virus is still active. And now I'm the one with the only monster on the field. How does it feel? 800 life points in a dream, baby. We will use welcome to Sovereign Ariana to give us Stovey. Which we will activate right away. To give us welcome. And now I will target Fair Welcome as a backup because we are really low on health, just in case. And now we will attack. You still have a turn, but my field is set. What will you do? Show me that card. Super Poly. The virus is still active, baby. Now what? Ooh. Ooh. That was a good one. I think that was a good one. It went back and forth. You know, Despia, Branded, Fright for whatever. They have so much they could do in the grave, so... I was scared when this happened. <laughs> Very. <laughs> but we pulled it off. Good job, Labyrinths. Labyrinths are so fun, too. Oh, man. All right, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this video, I hope this replay, I hope this duel, this battle was so intense enough for you that you decided to like and subscribe. I don't know. That's just me. I would have. <laughs> have a great one, y'all. Peace.